Hello, hello, hello. I am Dana Malone, your Oklahoma Cannabis Paralegal. And I don't know if you've seen my previous videos on the fire marshals um, packet for the certificate of occupancy or not, but I wanted, I got a little bit of additional information because I've been getting a lot of questions regarding greenhouses. Um, and if they have crushed rock for a floor or a pad for a floor, or they don't have any floor at all. And so I was speaking with the fire marshal uh, yesterday regarding some of these issues. And he um, gave me a, a little bit of information. Now I am going to be meeting with him next week or the following week, and we are going to go in depth about the greenhouses as well as some other things that I've got questions, other questions I have for him. So, but I'm, I'm getting hit a lot about, you know, greenhouses. And so here's what I have found out. This is not all inclusive, but again, this is what I have found out. Greenhouses are a U classification. That means utility if no grow lights have been introduced in the building. Um, when grow lights are introduced, that changes the classification from a utility classification to, I don't, he didn't specifically say, but to another classification. Um, pad or no pad, it's still new construction and a permit must be pulled and an, a COO must be obtained. I guess I forgot to lock my computer. Anyway, um, a, a, a certificate of, of occupancy must be obtained. But for greenhouses, it's going to be easier to get your certificate of occupancy. They are trying to come up with a way to make it even more easy or easier and so that's information that he hopes to have ready for me next week or when, the following week when we meet. So bear with us while they try to figure out how to make life easier for greenhouse owners. You still have to have a certificate of occupancy, but it's a different process. So I am going to be getting information on that process, detailed information. So just bear with us while we, while they work through the process and I learn how to do it. So um, stay tuned because more is going to come on this situation, uh, not situation, on this matter. So have a great day. If you've got questions, Put them in the comment section. I answer every question personally, but um, put them in wherever you see this video if you've got questions. If you've got a question that you would like for me to ask the fire marshal, put it in the uh, comments and I will write it down and I will take it with me. Um, if you've got other things that you wanna talk about, uh, give me a call, 918-900-0470. I am with Bridie and Associates. I am the paralegal to Isaiah Bridie and to Kaya Kennedy when she needs my assistance. She is our associate attorney. So anyhow, um, just reach out to me if you've got questions. Reach out to our firm if you need assistance. And uh, I will be talking to you soon.